So Together Two Festival is a culmination of working with different community groups across the city to help develop arts and theatre programmes where they are and then have a beautiful celebration that brings them all into the building. We've had choirs, we've had beautiful dance pieces, we've had co-created plays by young people. This evening we have our fantasy costume catwalk. So it's a real variety of stuff, a real celebration of the creativity of the city and what it means to us to get to open our buildings out. The people of Sheffield. I am so proud of every single person that's been on stage today. I'm so excited for them, they were fantastic. You work so hard in it and you see it progressing. You see not only yourself put a lot of hard work in, but the children. So to see the final product come to life and everybody smiling and the audience enjoying it, it was really beautiful. It was a lovely moment. This is when the buildings are at their most fun and vibrant and alive and joyous. It's been a really generous atmosphere of people getting involved, being curious about what's happening and wanting to try things out. We've had an origami station downstairs. We've got listening stations where people can hear poetry from community members. We have our wonderful memory map of Sheffield co-devised by Chili Peps young community leaders who have been on the ground reporters yesterday as well. So I think the vibe has been of celebration, curiosity. It's been electric, it's been great. With grit and gumption they began to regenerate. The dirty old city now was gone. What is your name and where are you from? My name is Neto and I'm from Ghana. What have you experienced at the festival today? Costume, photo shoot thing, stand-up comedian, origami. We wanted to try and reflect the diversity of the city as well. So the groups that have contributed and co-created come from all across Sheffield. And it's things like the memory map that really reflect that and represent that Sheffield is a place where people arrive, people feel safe, people feel a sense of belonging, and that's exactly what we want the theatres to feel like as well. Personal highlight for me so far, I mean, so many brilliant performances. Story Bombs, the Pinder Dance Group. Actually, a personal highlight was making my own wand up in the Adelphi room with some really brilliant crafts up there. We have been running costumed life drawing today. Everyone's loved it. Everyone's had a really great time. So it was really nice just seeing that um, journey, even in like an hour long workshop. It was about the people having the confidence to get up and talk. Personally playing Puck in A Midsummer's Night Dream, that was really, really fun. It gives you an opportunity to work with professionals, which is great. It's always such a mixed company and mixed ages and people at different levels of experience. Everyone should join. <laughs> It was a right laugh and a giggle and nearly made me cry, but I managed to hold it in. And it was so brilliant that they shared that with us and the audience, you know, gave them a standing ovation. It's been a really nice engagement before then. I don't think I've been to the theatre for 20 years. Without that engagement, that outreach to us out in S2 and stuff, I probably still wouldn't have gone to the theatre. An absolute privilege. And it's all about the community coming together, creating something that's also accessible for theatre goers, yeah. everybody, you know, theatre traditionally has an always been that accessible. With this being free it's a lot more accessible so that people are able to access this sort of culture and I think it's really important. This is the second time we've performed in this building as side by side. Just something I'll never ever forget. It's fantastic. I've created this film with my brother. It's like a video game. It's an amazing opportunity to me like to share my experience with more people. Absolutely wonderful. Each and every one of them have been so good I was uh, very nervous, but once you got in, uh, the crowd was absolutely incredible. I think it's really important that we use occasions like this to shout it loud and proud that these theatres are for everyone. We have moments in the year where we throw our doors open and let people feel a sense of belonging. And that's exactly what we've had over the past two days and what I look forward to the theatre doing for many more years to come. Mm -hmm.